on this very first evening of Ramadan, so much will be shared about the beauty of the days that await us. And I wonder if the Prophet Muhammad وسلم, was with us today and he had access to social media. What would he have posted this evening about the month of Ramadan? What would he have chosen to say? Well, I think that the following narration really does give us a hint about what he may have just said. Because on one year, when Ramadan had arrived, he ascended the pulpit and made a public announcement to the companions saying, قَدْ جَاءَكُمْ رَمَضَانْ شَهْرٌ مُبَارَكٌ The month of Ramadan has come to you. A blessed month. إِفْتَرَضَ اللَّهُ عَلَيْكُمْ صِيَامَهُ Wherein Allah has obligated within it fasting. تُفْتَحُ فِيهِ أَبْوَابُ الْجَنَّةِ Where the gates of paradise are opened. وَيُغْلَقُ فِيهِ أَبْوَابُ الْجَحِيمِ And the gates of the hellfire are locked up. وَتُغَلُّ فِيهِ الشَّيَاطِينَ And the devils are chained up. فِيهِ لَيْلَةٌ خَيْرٌ مِنْ أَلْفِ شَهْرٍ مَنْ حُرِمَ خَيْرَهَا فَقَدْ حُرِمْ And within this month there is a night that is superior to 1,000 months. And whoever is deprived of the goodness of that night has certainly been deprived. Those were his words. Had the Prophet ﷺ been with us on this evening, he would have most likely congratulated the Muslims for the gift of a month. The gift of a month that many of us are yet to appreciate the weight of. And that is why Imam Ibn Rajab al-Hanbali he said that some scholars have said this hadith, the one that we just cited, this hadith is a key evidence for the practice of congratulating one another for the arrival of the month of Ramadan. And then he says, Allahu Akbar. He said, why shouldn't the believer be congratulated when the gates of paradise have opened? Why shouldn't the sinner be congratulated when the gates of hell have been closed? Why shouldn't the intelligent one be congratulated for a time when the devils are chained? He said, how can this month be compared to any other time? So, first things first, to all of those who are experiencing the very first night of Ramadan, to all of those who intend to use the month of Ramadan as a month of reformation and serious worship and genuine change, I say to you many, many congratulations.